Share. When looking around for a new sofa bed to purchase for your home, it's important to consider the features you may need for your room. You may also want to consider anyone who may potentially use the sofa bed and their needs. With that in mind, here are the different types of sofa beds for you to acquaint yourself with. Sleeper Sofa Chair A sleeper sofa is unique from most of the sofa bed types available. This is because as opposed to a typical sofa bed that is meant to have all of the pieces laid out flat in order to form a bed, it has a regular mattress to sleep on. Storage Sofa Bed Chair On top of this, you get tons of storage space, of course. There are different types of storage beds from full-size sofa beds to compact futons to sofa beds with portable under-mattress storage. If you don't happen to have a lot of storage space available in the area, but would like to get the added benefit of having some. A storage sofa bed will serve its purpose quite well for you. Pull-out couch. The same seat then pushes upwards and outwards. A pull-out couch is extremely easy to use. It doesn't require much to set up. Once it's out and you've successfully pulled it out, all you really need to do is to add a comfortable duvet and you're pretty much good to go. Your sofa bed is ready. Dave, it's great because it can easily transition from a sofa to an actual full-size bed at the drop of a hat. You can usually identify a dave straight away because it usually has a headboard that is extended along one side of it. Click clack sofa bed. Share. Once that is done, you need to make sure that you tilt the head of the bed back. This means that you are going to need ample enough floor space for the bed to have all of the needed moving parts. Corner sofa beds. Share. If you don't have that much floor space to begin with, and if you have dead spaces near the corner of your room that you would like to utilize, then a corner sofa bed just might work for you. This type of sofa bed offers far more sleeping space compared to the typical L-shaped bed. It can also be quite easily converted into a much bigger sleeping space. A frame sofa bed. Share. This is a nifty way to ensure that the bed stays stable and level at all times. The a frame sofa bed is easily one of the most comfortable sofa bed types to sleep and so if that's something particularly important to you, then this type of sofa bed is definitely something worth looking into. Chair beds. Share. Chair beds are convertible pieces of furniture that are a marriage between a living room chair, your couch, and a bed. They are oftentimes equipped with retractable seats that extend all the way out, and they usually have a back seat that can be lowered in case you want to convert it into a bed. Futon sofa bed. There are so many types of futons out there. The term futon actually came from the Japanese, and when directly translated, is the actual equivalent of the word bed. How a futon sofa bed typically works is that it has a backrest that you would have to push down. This transforms the furniture into a flat surface that you can then sleep on. Power Open Sofa Bed Share A power open sofa bed is particularly interesting as it is a type of sofa bed that opens itself up all on its own the moment that you or anyone else enters the room. They are quite convenient but on top of this, they are quite easy to operate. One thing to keep in mind though is that if you happen to have a space challenged area, power open sofa bed might not be the best sofa bed option for you. Love Seat Sofa Bed Share Loveseat sofa beds are much smaller compared to your typical sofa bed. Normally, when not in use or when not extended out fully, a sofa bed doubles over as a couch. Stacking sofa bed. The first piece at the bottom functions as a base while the second piece stacked atop it works as a seat. Stacking beds are great for very small and cramped spaces. They are compact and extremely lightweight. Sofa bunk bed. Share. A sofa bunk bed is a hybrid type of sofa bed. If the typical sofa bed transforms into a sleeping mattress or bed, a sofa bunk bed transforms into it's a modern marvel and it will be even fair to say that it's a bit of an engineering feat sofa bed size it share the sizing of sofa beds is usually determined by the mattress that's inside the actual sofa bed that's the first size to consider after that is the sofa's overall size sofa beds that have bigger arms will obviously have bigger sizes compared to sofa beds with smaller or more compact arms. best type of a sofa bed share the next thing to consider is the budget you have for it and of course, you need to think about the aesthetics, any add-on features, and the amount of space it will actually consume. All of these things considered, the conclusion is that a great compromise that can cover most of these things would be the traditional pull-out sofa bed. How to choose a sleeper sofa? Share. First, you need to check the quality of the mattress. Since you're mostly planning to sleep on it, you need to ensure that you will be getting great sleep quality out of it. Look for types of mattresses that support the weight of your body, particularly your hips shoulders, and lower back when in a supine position. A thicker mattress doesn't always mean it's better so always keep an eye out for ones that are built well, even if they may be thinner. Second, make sure it has a smooth and sturdy open. 
and close mechanism. It should be able to lift up and go out in one motion. It should be smooth and shouldn't have any parts sticking or squeaking while you're at it. It's best if you go for sleeper sofas that have locked down bars. Third, take a look at the frames. You'll want to go for durable frames, maybe sturdy metal or hardwood. Avoid buying frames that are made out of softwoods or MDF boards as they wouldn't last very long. Fourth, always test it out. Get a good feel for it. Try opening and closing it. Try sitting on it and laying on it. And lastly, make sure that you measure it. Always take out the exact measurements both of the sleeper sofa you are buying and the space that you are installing it on before committing to buying it. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.